Ain't this a sweet life? And all of a sudden, they went, ladies and gentlemen, Montgomery Gentry. It was the loudest thing I have ever heard to date. And they hit it, and they're just screaming, and they're playing as loud as they can, and they get to the very end of the song, zap! And the whole crowd turns around and looks at me. And I'm sitting there. <laughs> no clap, no anything. Everybody's just looking at me, and I went, and people started clapping, and then they turned around and started watching. It was a total setup. That's amazing. I was so pissed off. I was so pissed off. <laughs> so we stayed there, and I watched it, and I finally said, Mr. Doris, get me out of here. Get me in the car. So we got in the car, and he goes, Blake, I'm sorry that I misled you, but I knew this was the only way you would get them up here. So about four hours, we talked coming home, and I finally said, I'll tell you what. I'll give you the worst record deal in the history of mankind. They were the other act that I gave that same bad deal to, that I gave to <laughs> the girls. And I said, but we'll figure this out. And, but the good thing is, is my friend Joe Skate did figure it out. And we ended up, they did get a real deal. And then they had right. hillbilly shoes and had some hits. And then they slowed down. And then that's when I jumped in and started doing my town and that. Ain't this a sweet life?